here at a junkyard with classics and wrecks. And some of them, try to pull that bed through the door. Some of them are classic wrecks. Like this one. Like this bed might just be laying on a nice pin rack. I thought so. <laughs> Look here. What kind of contraption was that? Maybe a flip nose? <sighs> There's a lot of stuff here, guys. Guys trying to keep your car 80s and 90s on the road. Oh, what's that BMW, I think? You guys, an oldie. I'm missing a couple guys. I don't remember thinking, oh, I'll catch that one when I get over there. No, I passed it. Yeah, we'll come back up around. Like I said, this ain't gonna be a one day thing. Oh man, chop top. Look at the chrome on that. Yep, yeah, this is the one he's talking about. It was one father. But yeah, that was a nice ride. That car is hot. You think I it was literally really hot. I think sometimes it just gets a little bit of fire to it. Like hot around it to burn the paint, it's alright. But when it's really burnt up, it weakens the metal. Look at Chop Top. I'm telling you, I watched Bad Chad, and I think this would be considered sloppy. <laughs> Which is hard to tell how long ago it was done, too, guys. That's a cool one. What is that car? Is it a Merc? Got the big old chrome pipes. Look, smart bug. Old car guys know what that is. Get a switch and shoot fire out the back end of it. Man, I bet that was a beautiful car. And the incisions where it's chopped, had the door handle shaved, and they chopped it, and they chopped it, pretty darn cool. And we got us a little bonus way. Man, I have to say, I know I'm going to miss so many because there's so many in this little area. And this yard goes on and on. It's got a building for it. 20s cars on the way up. So what we got is a swinger. It's a Dodge. So probably a dark. I think Plymouth did the swinger, didn't they guys? Oh, looks like man the body was pretty good on that. Until it got hit. Presentable interior. Presentable. Clean that baby up. Bottom top. I always bring it up, don't they, guys? Is that a dart? I get confused on these ones. The year they made so many, the Mopar, like a Plum Swinger, Dodge Dart, different ones. That crossfire got hit hard. Hard hit, hard hit. That's a new thing for me, guys, showing wreck cars. I, I get a few every now and then. Most of them are brought in just as junk cars and ain't. Uh, a wreck ride. A little Porsche, I'm thinking. Mid 80s, 84, 85 ish.
thought these things are cool. They looked like they had a body kit from factory on them, you know. But, you know, I was young. I mean, I don't really care for them now. But, you know, I wouldn't pass one up. It was a good deal to pass on. Now, this one is Mopar. And it's late 50s, early 40s. Tell me in the comments, guys. And got the little wide wheels on the back. Look at that. <laughs> Plymouth. Oh, yeah, it's a work in the process here. See, they got starting on a tub job back there. Just gotta finish the sheet now. Oh, look at that. That's a beautiful speaker right there. How it has the emblem on it. Bumblebee. That's cool how it says vehicle number. Quite a few MGs in here at one place. There's a 74 and up. do another part here guys we'll probably end up with 10 or 12 parts seems like you guys get we're out at eight or nine minutes trying to make them different radios keep being you guys